I was running out here because, uh, what's his name, Twitch, uh, Twitch. <laughs> was on the TikTok, and he was talking to his TikTok people, and I was talking with him to the TikTok people, and then before I knew it, <laughs> here she is now, and then I wasn't. No, I wasn't here at all, I was there. Uh, anyway, how's everybody doing? Good, good. Oh, good, the puppy is even saying the puppy is good. The little <laughs> St. Bernard puppy, or whatever that is, it's cute. So uh, March is here, and um, I can't believe, but this year has just flown by. <laughs> is it over? OK. Um, what's the last? That's, it's not March, is it? It doesn't end with March. OK. With December. I know that. So uh, March, no, what March is, is March is uh, spring is right around the corner. That's what March means. And uh, it means spring cleaning. Who's, who's going to be spring cleaning for? for Yep, some people, some people shaking their head no. <laughs> Are you at least uh, planning on taking down the Halloween decorations? Who's doing that? <laughs> people leave Halloween decorations. I understand Christmas kind of, because it's festive, but Halloween decor, really? <laughs> I'm off course today. Um, Anyway, for those of you who are doing spring cleaning, I, I'm going to give you some cleaning hacks, because these are interesting to me. They're little tricks that you can use for tough cleaning projects, uh, like uh, getting uh, the wine stains out of your carpet, you know, or getting the wine stains out of your couch, or uh, getting the wine stains out of your bed, or getting wine stains out of the chair that you're sleeping in because your couch and your bed have wine stains on them. <laughs> anyway. Here's, I see you're drinking wine when I'm saying it. I like it. Here's the first cleaning hack. Don't have kids. <laughs> Don't have kids. According to a survey that I conducted talking to three of my staff members with kids, children cause 95% of the world's messes. That's a study I conducted. And uh, I don't have kids, so I don't have to clean that often. But when I do have to clean, it's because it's my own damn fault or because Portia got her markers out and drew on the walls again. Um, speaking of markers, here's a hack. These are all true. They're helpful. Um, you can use cheap hairspray to get ink out of fabric. This is great if you're the type of person who writes with an old-fashioned uh, inkwell, uh, like an old-timey feather or something like that, and you have a huge perm to care for. But here's the thing. What you do is you spray the ink, uh, let it sit for a few minutes, and then rinse the stain away. But it only works with cheap hairspray that has alcohol in it. It does not work with expensive hairsprays like Gorilla Glue or whatever the kids are using. OK? All right. Another cleaning hack is you can use a grapefruit dipped in sugar to clean the shower. And I learned this on TikTok, so it must be true. You take the half of the grapefruit and the, and the salt, and the, I mean, some sugar. I, I know what I'm saying, Andy. I'm the one with the hacks. Okay. The citric acid cuts through the soap scum, and then uh, it gets the job done very quick. But you have to uh, take a break every once in a while because the grapefruit squirts in your eye. My eye! <laughs> oh, my eye. <laughs> and then you can use also, uh, listen to this, Coke to remove all oil stains in your garage. Here's how it works. You do some Coke and you stay up all night long and you scrub and scrub and scrub. <laughs> till the Coke wears off. No, what you do... You pour room temperature Coca-Cola on the stain and let it sit overnight. And then the next day, you have no more oil stains, plus you have thousands of ants and bees. <laughs> Tune in next week when I tell you how to get rid of ants and bees. <laughs> Here's one more interesting tip. Did you know that you can use a walnut to get scratches out of wood? There are oils in a walnut that absorb into the wood and make it look like new. Someone's shaking her head. She knew that. Andy, do you have any scratches on your uh, wood furniture at home? I'm, sh I'm sure we do. All right. Well, yeah. you go home and you rub a nut against your wood. <laughs> OK? That, that was a dirty joke about cleaning. 